Hi, I'm Jay Ward, the creative director of Franchise at Pixar Animation Studios. In my 25 years at Pixar, I started on the production side working on films like Monsters, Inc. and Cars and Ratatouille, but later in my career, I transitioned to being a creative director. So my job now is to oversee other projects, Disney projects around the world, at theme parks, publishing, games, consumer products. You never know what it is, but they're always involved in some way that we bring Pixar out into the world. Probably one of my favorites is designing Cars Land with the team from beginning to end. So that was five years of my life, and in the end, we created a whole new land at Disney's California Adventure that lives on to this day and is such a special thing to go to. So I'd say Cars Land, probably one of my favorites. I'm excited to be visiting our Disney program participants to talk a little bit today about what I do at Pixar Animation Studios. I'd say the thing that struck me most when I visited was how nice this campus is. I'm going back to my college days and it did not look like this, so you are very blessed to be in such a nice place, such a nice campus to work. Yeah, this, this place is beautiful and reminds me a little bit of Pixar. I'll say you guys have that collaborative spirit and you have that openness going and you really have this energy that I hope stays here for a long time. I get a lot of people ask me, what could I do to get a creative career going for myself within Disney? And I'll say the first thing is, if you like to draw, draw a lot. Build up a great portfolio. If you like to tell stories, start writing some stories. Tell the stories you want to tell and just keep working with other people and collaborating and getting better at your craft. Ask a lot of questions. Associate with a lot of people who are more creative and more talented than you. Try to absorb that energy from those people around you. Whatever I'm involved in, whatever I'm excited about, I find the person in the room that knows more than me about that subject and I gravitate to them. And by surrounding yourself by people who are really great at their craft, it will bring you up. If you end up in an atmosphere where you're the person who knows the most, then you need to find another atmosphere where you can learn from somebody around you. So always surround yourself by greatness. I have been very fortunate working at Pixar, being mentored by some of the most talented, creative people in the industry and I think the greatest thing for all of us is and it's a really simple thing is just be nice be kind I'd say that working there the fortunate thing is you're surrounded by people who are talented but are also really great to work with and if you don't like the people you're working with you're not really gonna get much out of your career no matter whatever the project is no matter how great it is how much you know amazing the film is if you don't like the people you're working with you're gonna have a hard time so I'd say it's not only surrounding yourself with greatness but also surround yourself with people that you want to work with I'm very fortunate because I had a passion for automobiles and cars before I came to Pixar. Now my first film there was Monsters Inc. which had really nothing to do with cars, but the very next film was the movie Cars. So as I started on it, it was the first time when I realized something that I was passionate about and enjoyed in my outside life also coincided with what I was doing in my career. Now that's not always gonna happen. And I think it's important for people to have a healthy balance. You should love working for Disney and love what you do, but your personal passions may be separate or they may be intrinsic. It doesn't have to be. Find your fulfillment in yourself first and then I think you'll find fulfillment in your job. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for joining me and I hope you get something informative out of it. Bye.